channel catfish are very hard fighting, good tasting sport fish and food fish native to many ponds, lakes, oxbows, man-made impoundments, sloughs, swamps, canals, gravel pits, warm streams, and rivers in the northeast United States. Channel catfish can tolerate moderate pollution and very muddy water. They mainly eat bait fish, panfish, fish eggs, insect larvae, mollusks, crustaceans, aquatic plants, and dead organic material. They have an acute sense of smell and thanks to their whiskers, taste as well. They generally bite well during the day and better at night. Channel catfish spawn when the water temperature reaches 70 degrees and often in enclosed areas such as barrels, hollow logs, and muskrat runs. In rivers, after the spawn, channel catfish are attracted to snags such as trees and deeper water, and they also congregate behind dams and along current breaks of river pools and runs. During floods, they push into edges of slack water that normally don't exist when the water is at normal level. During winter, they congregate in great numbers in deep wintering holes or, if available, the warm water discharge of power plants. Occasionally, channel catfish are caught on lures, but most by far are taken with bait. Channel catfish especially prefer live bait fish or oily cut bait such as sucker, chub, shad, or herring, but they will settle for cut pickerel, trout, or sunfish. They also bite hot dogs, shrimp, stink bait, worms, crawfish, chicken liver, and other animals and meats. Trophy channel catfish often only bite on the oiliest cut bait or live bait, and they often hide away where they're unlikely to be caught. Casting into the hard water will attract nearby channel catfish, as well as draw up ones from fairly far downstream. Sturdy circle hooks, octopus hooks, and bait holder hooks, possibly paired with a stinger hook, all work well for catfish, where a circle hook is set by reeling in, while the other hooks are set by sweeping the rod back quickly. Rigs for effectively catching channel catfish include a free line approach, slip sinker rig variants, dropper loop rig, drift rig with split shot or a dropper, and a float rig. Types of specialty rigs are numerous and include bottom bouncing rigs, bait walker rigs, and float and slip sinker combo rigs. Spinning and bait casting, bait casting outfits paired with strong line and medium heavy power, moderate action rods are ideal for channel catfish. Sometimes in the evening and night, fresh catfish will make runs up river, passing through dead spots. Drifting by boat and using a bottom rig, float rig, or shanty rig can also be effective. Water level fluctuations tend to affect the behavior of channel catfish in rivers more than in lakes. Channel catfish may suspend on the thermocline during temperature extremes, and in this situation, drift or float fishing works best. On the other hand, bullhead are very easy to catch and even more tolerant of pollution, muddy water, and low dissolved oxygen than channel catfish. They can survive all year in bodies of water that normally experience winter kill. They are much smaller than channel catfish, have a square tail instead of a fork tail like channel catfish, and they come in three types, black bullhead, brown bullhead, and yellow bullhead. Black bullhead tolerate muddier water while yellow bull and brown bullhead prefer clearer water. Like channel catfish, they have an acute sense of smell and taste, and they eat insect larvae, snails, worms, fish eggs, aquatic insects, and bait fish. Just after ice out, bullheads will push into bays to feed if the bay has murky water from flooding and the bite will be hot. Otherwise, they will spawn and push into shallow basins a month later. Bullhead occasionally hit lures, but most of the most effective way to catch them is to use live bait. Worms work especially well, either baited on a float rig or a slip sink rig variant. Bullhead are not line shy and will swallow the hook almost every time. So one way to make fishing easier is to use a snap swivel and a removable snell, changing it out for a new snell every, for every subsequent bullhead. In winter, the bullhead stage deep, hitting ice jigs occasionally, but one way to catch them more consistently is to use tip-ups baited with worms with the bait sent to the bottom.